but I think maybe what would be interesting to kind of start this whole thing off with would be a foundational understanding of what SecOps is. So Svetla, from, from your standpoint, if you were going to describe to somebody in an elevator, like 90 seconds, what, what really is SecOps now? Okay, so uh, be explained to me like I'm five trick. Okay, that's, that's a good one. Uh, the way I usually describe it is uh, that organizations today have, call it cameras and motion sensors all over their perimeter, and they produce all kinds of alerts. Something happened, you may want to take a look at that, right? And with the complexity of how this tooling has evolved, how the attackers have evolved, this just becomes one of the most complex operational issues that organizations have to deal with is just tracking and monitoring and making sure they don't miss something. Um, so SecOps, in I think in my very simple terms, is kind of the art and science of looking at a million things a day or a billion things a day and... Um, doing your best not to miss something. Couldn't agree more. And I think more and more organizations are getting to the point where there is so much data, so many sensors, and they are afraid of missing something. And that's part of the reason why we're hearing about automation, orchestration, and taking what used to be our level one and level two analysts and turning more and more and more of that into machine learning, automating certain pieces of it, orchestrating and, and leveraging AI, because I think that's actually one of the things that it's good at. And I, I think a lot of our listeners know by now, I don't consider it artificial intelligence. I call it augmented intelligence. So we're, we're telling these systems what to do. And then we're saying, look for patterns, look for things that are out of the norm, and then maybe do some things on your own. But here's the box. You have to stay in the box. And if you go outside of the box, then we need to let people know. And then we have a human that steps in and, and kind of does the things. So I think that's that's where we are currently for SACOPS.